On August 6, 1995, Paraguayan soldiers showed up at the home of the Maciel family and took away their 15-year-old son, Victor Hugo. Two months later, military officials brought his dead body back home. In his tenure as chairman of the Inter-American Commission on Human Rights, Notre Dame law professor Paolo Carazza was instrumental in improving the protection of the rights of children in Paraguay and throughout the Americas. The forced recruitment of child soldiers into the Paraguayan military had been a common practice for decades. Achieving change required understanding the obstacles that the government faced, and then working with those government officials who were willing to change. In 2006, through Professor Carazza's diplomatic efforts, the Paraguayan government publicly acknowledged human rights violations and enacted legal reforms to outlaw the enlistment of child soldiers. Como representante del gobierno, Shepun Aguirre, ayer urende perdona Francisca. A pensaba que era hogado y su pela, o hija o botilla. Ah, y mi lado pico. At Notre Dame, we're trying to teach our students that law isn't merely an exercise of power. It has a larger purpose. That purpose is to serve the good and dignity of human persons. The University of Notre Dame asks, what would you fight for? Fighting for human rights. We are the Fighting Irish. <laughs>